Hi, I hope that you're extremely good. On this lesson, I'm going to teach you types of angles. They are very crucial and important because in most cases, you'll be asked a question that will be needing you to know these types of angles. Right. The first thing I want you to know and understand is what an angle is. An angle is a measure. An angle is a measure of rotation or turning that is what we call an angle right there are about five main types of angles that i want you to know that are very crucial and important to you the first one it is called an acute angle right acute angle so what is an acute angle and how does it look like? An acute angle is an angle that will be less than 90 degrees. So I'm going to use uh, X to represent the angle, right? So it means an acute angle, it will be like this, right? That is what we call an acute angle. It will be less than 90 degrees, right? Then the second one, we have got the right angle this one it is exactly 90 degrees that is what you call the right angle right angle is exactly 90 degrees then we have got uh, obtuse and obtuse obtuse angle it will be I'm going to write in front I hope that it will be clear obtuse is going to be, I'm going to represent, uh, to use X to represent the obtuse angle. It will be more than 90 degrees, but less than 180 degrees. That is what you call an obtuse angle. Then we have got um, straight angle. Right, a straight angle it is exactly 180 degrees that is what called a straight angle why is it called a straight angle because it is created by a straight line that is why it is called a straight angle right then number five we have got what is called a reflex a reflex angle reflex angle it will be more than 180 degrees but less than 360 degrees that is what you call a reflex angle right the last one ah uh, it's not necessary to write it right the last one it is called revolution 360 a complete 10 it is called revol okay let me write it uh some of you you like everything Right, revolution. Exactly 360 degrees. So in other terms, a circle is a complete revolution or a circle is revolution. Right, so this is, or oh, these are types of angles that we have, types of angles that are very crucial and important for you to know them. Then the other thing when it comes to angles that I want you to know is, what are called complementary angles? What are supplementary angles? It's very simple and straightforward. Supplementary angles, okay, let me start with complementary angles. Complementary angles are angles that add up to 90 degrees. That is what we call complementary angles. So if you ask to write the complement of uh, 50 degrees, what are you going to do? You are just going to say 90 minus 50. You'll be asked to write an angle that will make 50, 90, or an angle that you add to 50 for you to get 90, you see that it, is, it will be 40. So what you just need to take note of and know and understand, or what you just need to know, is that complementary angles are angles that add up to 90 degrees. Then supplementary angles are angles that add up to 180 degrees. Those are what we call supplementary angles. Right, I hope that you now know and completely understand the types of angles that we have. If you have got any question when it comes to angles or if there is anything that is not uh, very clear to you, 
feel free to let me know on the comment section here on Semp of TV YouTube channel. My wish and prayer is for you to understand mathematics, for you to see that maths was easy, is easy, and shall be always easy. If and if only you stay focused. You should subscribe to this channel for more beneficial lessons like this. This is beneficial to you and your friends. You can introduce your friends to Sample of TV site like that they will all or they will as well benefit from these um, lessons. I hope that you are safe wherever you are and you are always trying by all means to stay focused. Revise mathematics each and every day. That is the only way you can pass and have a distinction in math. I don't want to lie to you as I always say that maths is very easy. If and if only you stay focused. So you should stay focused.